everybody and welcome back to this Microsoft Flight Sim video. Today in this quick fix series, we're going to have a quick look at some of our camera settings. So by default, if you're on the outside of the aircraft, you're going to be greeted with this a heads up display with a whole load of cool stuff, uh, but maybe you don't want them there. Also, when it comes to moving your camera or panning your camera from the outside, well, a lot of people are kind of stuck with these snap views. There is a way to make everything go a lot smoother. So first things up, we go into our main menu. We're going to start with our assistance options. That's going to turn off our HUD. So all we need to do, we go to our uh, user interface, ramble down here, and we check out where it says instrument heads up display. And you can see that you can have this on either inside the aircraft in the cockpit or outside. So it goes from full, minimal, or to off. We're going to turn this off. We click apply and save. We go back. Now we want to go into our general options. And from in here, we go to camera. Scroll all the way down to the bottom and we're looking for the chase camera settings. We're gonna change two things here. The first is gonna be the POV reset. Set that to manual. And then your external free look speed, bring that all the way over to the left to about 10. We're gonna hit apply and save. And now from the outside, our HUD is missing, but we can now just pan around the aircraft even use the roller ball on your mouse to zoom in and use your directional arrows to get to those views. Now, you don't need to worry about what angle you have it at. And if you're jumping from your cockpit position, and if you want to go back outside, you remember what angle it left the aircraft in. This is really handy if you're going to record a video or, you know, when you're on takeoff, just as you pull up to see yourself leave the runway. It's just, it adds to getting better screenshots and it just makes checking out the details of your aircraft a little bit better. So, short and sweet, to the point, I hope. We'll see you on the next one. 